you. You are Uncle Hillary's lawyer. Ugo, I, I can't explain. Explain what? There's absolutely nothing to explain. No reason at all. Peter, you don't even Please. understand. Peter! I am not here to fight. I'm here to talk to your father. And then talk. Bulldozer. Alone. I want to know what happened to my father. Anything new on Adelomo yet? No, sir. Just keep looking. I didn't want just walked out with someone who I suspect is a client, but is not on our books. Peter. Sir. Oh, Peter, this, this, this won't do. You have to go back. Adelomo came in. He almost caught me. I could have lost my job. I was worried about you and the profitability of the Lagos branch. Why don't you let me worry about running my own branch? You know what? I have had it with you and I have had it with the so-called partnership. I am done. In three months, you will have your closed sign. Put me down for half a million. Now get out of my house. Kalada invited me to dinner with you both. Yes, yes, I, I remember. Well, I know you may not know this, but um, I'm attracted to you. Right from then. I, I am, I'm, I'm, I'm flattered, thank you. Can I take you out on a date sometime? Like I just said, I am truly flattered, but I'm taken. So you had to lie to my face? Just like that? Wow. What? Your colleague told me that you're single. Sylvia? No, but you don't have to lie to me. Why, why, do, you, why do you do that? Have, have I ever put any kind of pressure on you? No. No, you, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I have a lot of respect for you, isn't it? I am willing to concede an adjournment for nine months to help them get on an even footing. More delay tactics, my lord. We are ready to proceed with this matter today. It has already taken too long, and my client has been suffering. Oh, we could throw out the case since they clearly have no proof that their client's inability to get work has anything to do with malicious intent on the part of my client. Rather, if we dig deeper, we will see that their client is at very best incompetent and at the very worst fraudulent in carrying out his duties. My lord! Mrs. Secretary, this is the third time this matter is before me and all you have for me are smoke and mirrors. Perhaps Mrs. Adebayo is right. You have no case. I'd love to take you out to dinner. Their case was closed. We're good. I'm not talking about the case. I'm talking about this warrior woman who defended me. Well, you could come by my office and... We... No, outside office. I mean, a more private setting. That will not be necessary. My bill will be at your office by the end of the day. Have a good day. Sharon? Uncle Justice! Uh, look at these children. What are you doing here? Do you have any business around here? You're my business. Me? Yes, I need you to tell me everything that happened when my father died. Haven't we already gone through this? Oi, yes, yes. don't look at her. Look at me. Tell me what happened when my father died. That's a conversation you need to have with your mother. Well, I am asking you, sir. And if you know you have nothing to hide and your hands are clean, you will stop with this wishy-washy behavior and just come clean. Come clean about what? Old oh, man, I'm about to lose my patience. I will ask you one more time. What happened when my father died? Oh, well, calm down. Or maybe this is not how to handle You were his doctor, for Christ's sake. Tell me what happened when he died.